Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Jay Cruz and welcome back to another video. In this one, we check out another close guitar. This time, the Pro Apollo. Let's get it. This video is once again sponsored by the great folks at Close Guitars. This time they sent over their Pro model. If you remember, I recently reviewed their standard model, which I'll link right up here. And man, that guitar was amazing. It surprised me with how clear it was and all of the great tones that I got from it. But now we have their Pro model. And in theory, this guitar should be technically better than the other guitar that we tried out. So I'm very, very excited about this one. There's some similar features on this guitar. That close bridge is the same. You got the same carbon fiber pick guard and of course this immaculate carbon fiber neck. However, this version features their locking tuners and a much different electronic setup here. They've included the Fishman Fluence pickups, a four-way selector switch, and this is a four knob configuration with a push pull coil feature. That means that we're going to be able to get a ton of variations and tones from your typical humbucker sound to a more clear humbucker type of tone and some single coil tones as well. These are active pickups so you do have a battery compartment for your 9 volt battery. While we're back here you can also see that this is a string through body as well. As you would expect with the carbon fiber it is a little bit lighter and the guitar itself is quite light but the body clearly because it's made of wood is a little heavier so for those of you who like an even guitar to body neck ratio i think you'll find that the body is a little more heavy therefore the guitar is not quite as even feeling in your hands but not to fret because this time close guitar sent me a nice little care package which includes their very own strap a t-shirt, some picks, a capo, and even their very, very special silent quarter inch cable. You'll never get a pop noise removing this cable even if your volume pedal is wide open because it has a special feature that will disengage if it's not actually plugged into an instrument. Let's stop talking about this guitar. Let's actually listen to it. Let's check out some of the tones that we get from it, the variety of tones that we can get from this guitar and its pickups. Then we'll talk about some of its pros and its cons.
This guitar is a special, special guitar. It has a lot of modern features that typically I would not normally gravitate to. Not that I like old guitars only, I don't mind a brand new build, but I do like to feel like I'm playing something that is more traditional feeling. However, this guitar really captures a, a variety of tones that I think could be a very special and must have style instrument to keep here in the studio, especially. Or maybe if you're a gigging musician that plays a ton of different music, I think this guitar could truly cover pretty much everything you would ever need to cover A to Z. Not only does this guitar sound good, but it also feels good in my hands, which is super important for me the neck is a little bit chunky which i like it's not like a baseball bat or vintage style radius at, in any kind of way but it isn't thin super thin and unplayable everything about it is pretty much done perfectly to be honest with you i've stayed away from a lot of these new fishman pickups i i appreciate the technology and what they're doing but it's i've always been a little fearful of these sort of emulating pickups or pickups that try to cover too much, like do too much. However, these really have proven to be amazing pickups, I have to say. They sound great, the technology is dead on accurate, and I have to say, they kind of look cool too. So we talked about the pros on this guitar, are there any cons? On this particular version, I think you have to be very nitpicky to find some of the cons. To me, the pickup configuration uh, or at least the way it's set up with the four knob thing, slightly confusing, but I honestly think it's just a matter of getting to know the guitar a little bit more. It took me a little while to figure out which knobs affected which pickup, but once I got the groove of it, it just kind of came second nature. So just a little bit of time with the pickup configuration and you'll get used to it. I wanna thank the folks again at Close Guitars for sending this guitar over. I'm so honored that they have trusted me, not once, but twice with two different instruments. Thank you so much. If you are interested in purchasing one of these guitars, please do me a favor, use the link that I'm providing in the description box below. Using that link will assist and help this channel out just a little bit. And not only that, use my affiliate code, CRUISE10, to get 10% off of your first purchase. While you're down there, please do all of the things that help this channel grow. Like the video, comment, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification icon so you get alerted every single time I upload a video. Thank you so much for watching and until next week.